Yeah, there we go. Uh, new, new rules for 2017. Yeah, so, yeah. You guys, so there's a lot going on, and next year there's a major change. And, you know, sometimes change is inevitable. And I've been sitting and talking with some very sharp business people. As you can see, this is a growing organization and getting bigger all the time. In fact, there are inquiries on the growth of this organization in other states. I've had to make a critical and very, very hard decision. And the decision was to change the name from HB Car Club to Cars and Crews Car Club. I had no choice. The, the, the decision has to be made for business reasons. And it's because what we're doing by, by labeling it Huntington Beach Car Club is we're shrinking the opportunity for any growth. There's a lot of sponsors that won't talk to me because they don't want to sponsor a Huntington Beach Community Car Club. They would rather sponsor a bigger organization that has more to offer them. And we have a lot of sponsors that are outside of this community that we feel can do a lot more. So I'm going to be explaining this in detail as we move forward. But HB Car Club exists. It's never going away. In fact, if you own an HB Car Club hat, shirt, decal, whatever, hang on to it. Because trust me, you're, uh, you're, you're in the uh, brotherhood of a foundation of the start of this thing and how it's grown and where it's going to grow to. It's become very, very, very big. And again, I got some good counseling before I made this decision, including a lot of you. I talked to quite a few of you before I made this decision to do this. It's inevitable. It has to be done because we have so much to look forward to. And the, the letters HB are going to limit the possibility of growth. If we don't do it now, it will bite us later. So hopefully you all understand. And I understand if you don't, you can talk to me, email me, make a phone call to me. Uh, the decision has been made, and I am moving forward, or I wouldn't be announcing it this way. The logos have been developed. They're beautiful. They're gorgeous. We've got some new things in the works for it. If you look at the website, you can start seeing what the logos look like. We're real excited about where we're going with this. And trust me, I'm making the decision for the group and, and for the growth of the organization to be the best it can possibly be. And I hope you support me, and I hope you support everyone else, because it is an important decision that had to be made. And I made it. So thank you very much, and let's uh, let's hear it. Um, so how many people are brand new tonight? Raise your hand if you're hey. new, first time here. Where? What are you driving? Cool. What are you driving? Dream. Cool and. Mitch and cool. Well, welcome aboard. We got over here. No, go, go, please. Okay, and also our sign-up list for the potluck is on uh, the front counter this Friday. So hopefully you guys can all make it and we can all have some fun. What time is it? It starts at uh, 5 o'clock. 5 to and whatever. anyone that wants to help us decorate beforehand. The actual, we'll around. start at 6, but people can ride yeah. at 5 and start setting up tables and all that stuff. Yeah. It's going to be, you guys, this is going to be very casual. Car club, holiday party, and yes, there will be alcohol. <laughs> Is that for you? Yeah. Uh, do, we, do we have Uber waiting out there? Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll have Uber. Uh, I also want to introduce Billy O'Connell, Councilman Billy O'Connell. He's here in the crowd. Let's give him a big hand. Hey, Billy. So today we took a massive truckload of goods over to Billy O'Connell's organization. I just want to have him say a few words about that organization and what they do and what they stand for. First of all, I want to thank each and every one of you for being here tonight and also for supporting uh, the work that we do. I run an organization called Colette's Children's Home where we take homeless women and children off the streets. So far this year, we've taken over 660 women and children off the streets. And since we've been called... Wow. Since we've incorporated, we've taken over 4,000 homeless women and children off the streets. We have helped over 1,300 women find work, and we have reunified hundreds of mothers with their kids. And that would not be happening only for people like you that care. So I thank each and every one of you. Thank you, Mel. So, let's, let's do this, too, because Caitlin and Jackie, I mean, they worked very hard this past month to put this together and get all the goods together and everybody delivery. They built, I think it was like 75 bags from uh, um, Simple Green, fixing a bunch of bags, and we filled them full of what we call a care package. You guys all delivered. Combs, socks, gloves, beanies, food, 
uh, women toiletry, whatever, you name it, was in those bags. And these two girls went out today <coughs> and yesterday and handed them out to all the homeless. We got good pictures of it. Give them a They said the reaction. Go ahead. What was like the people were like? It was priceless. It was it was awesome to go like put yourself kind of in their shoes, I guess. Like I just spent and I'm sure all of us did time with our families and you know over Christmas and everything and, and, and friends and for us to be able to give back to them when they could be out there with nobody it just felt good like everyone in the community came together and just gave back to everybody else and it was just awesome it was an awesome feeling thank you guys right, so tonight's all about the cruise cruise night and I'm telling you we got I lost count of the cars but I think we're pushing about 75 cars out there so we've got a pretty big crowd and let me, let me explain to you again, the <clears throat> rules are the rules. And for some reason, when we get a big group like this, people break the rules. And it only, you're only hurting everybody in the room. When you think you're doing something cool, you're not. We already know your car can go fast. A lot of us have fast cars. We know that. This is a cruise. It's a cruise down memory lane. It's a cruise for the families down there to enjoy watching this parade of cars go by. And, the, and you're going to get excited. Tonight, there's a large group of people waiting for us. It was advertised in several newspapers. I mean, we really pounded the, the uh, media and we really got a lot of things. So I'm assuming it's a big group down there. When we get down there, you guys, no burnout, please. It's as simple as that. Not even just a chirp of your wheels. I don't want to hear, oh, I was a slip. Don't do it. It's not worth it. Okay, we don't want to take that chance. There are going to be a lot of kids downtown. That's what this is all about tonight. Really? We're giving all the kids a goodie bag when we get down there. Jack, you guys got to take off now, too. Um, so give Nobody let Daniel forget his money. That's yeah, what we're trying cool. to tell him. Yeah. He's like, give him a hand. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, this is all about the kids. So if there's kids down there and you're, you know, spinning your tires, you'll see people down there going like this and telling you to egg you on. Don't do it. Just say no. We're not, we're not about that. It's not what we're doing down there. We're just cruising our cars. Now, the way the cruise works, we go one, one, um, one pass down Main Street. Sorry, I'm a little out of it. One pass down Main Street to Walnut. When we get to Walnut, we split. One car goes to the right, it comes up fifth, back to Orange, and back on the Main and does a second pass. The other car goes to the right, goes to third, comes up to Orange, and comes back. We do two passes on Main. Once we're done with the two passes, and once we're finished with that, everyone gets back down to Walnut on the second pass, take a left. We're all going to park our cars on the top floor of the parking structure on Walnut. So just pull into that parking structure, drive to the very top, and park your car, come down on the street. We're all going to go to Legends and have a beer or wine or a sandwich or a soda, whatever, toot your horn. Um, I think there's dinner tickets. We have $14 special deal for dinner at Legends. And by the way, if you're a car club member, anytime you want to go to Legends, you can. Um, it's, it's a discount program that we have through the car club. But remember, everybody here needs to stick together tonight. It's all about family. It's all about us. It's all about the holiday season. We don't want to see you go home tonight. We want you to come and join us at Legends. Say, hey, stick together. Even if you could just come by Legends for a couple minutes before you bail out, it would be well appreciated. I also want to give thanks for Hector from Bill Dunn is here tonight. Let's give Hector a little thanks. For those of you who don't know, we just had our floors done. I'm sure a lot of you already met um, Chet uh, Ruggio. He's in the back. He's had his display set up. Had all the floors set back there. With Chet. It's John from Platinum Black around. John, yeah, John from Platinum Black's here. And, and they're growing our company. We got John and his wife from right JNS Gear. Right here. John, yeah, there they are. Hey, John, you're giving a hand. Yeah. Yes. We got Darren from DW. Yeah, here we go. Say hi to Darren. Darren is, we just had a long talk. He's going to be coming on board as a new sponsor. So, anybody else I missed? If I did, I'm sorry. I'm on drugs. <laughs> oh, hey, oh, yeah. Jeff. <laughs> yeah. Hey, yeah. Jeff. You they guys gotta they go. got to stop him. I just went through 
my car just got done being at Jeff's shop. Talk about a level of professionalism. I'm blown away at what he's done. He's disassembled my car, all the trim running. But the amazing part was watching him put it all on a cart, bag it, label it. He's got it all on list. Let's give Jeff and Andy a big hand. So, and thank you guys for a great year. This is our last cruise for 2016. Kind of amazing. We started in January last year. Here we are in December and bigger and stronger and better. It's only getting more exciting. For those of you who aren't members of HP Car Club, we ask you and urge you, please come on board. It's a membership organization that grows with strength only in numbers. It's not about your $50. It's about your membership that means the most. The more people that sign up, the more people that join this club, the healthier and stronger we get to speak as a voice. Numbers speak loud. If I go talk to a sponsor or a vendor or somebody coming on board, it gets pretty exciting to them when, when you start telling them, you have 300, 400, 500 members. That gets very exciting. And that's what we're all about, just growing the club for you guys, for all of us, be able to get discounts, deals, VIP treatment, a lot of things that we're going to be doing in 2017 that we weren't able to do in 2016 is going to be exciting as well. So that's it. Let's uh, let's crank on the cars. Let's we have another okay, edition wait, 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 part of the in. cruise night. The way we I'm Dano. We're going to go live HB Hot Rod News here at the Detailing Pros. He's giving instructions week after week, so we're going to cut it off. I'm going to grab my things and get in the car and get downtown.